And I know a home Times like this Okay guys, today we're going to show you how to replace the handbrake handle So we've got two different kinds, obviously we've got the full carbon one So as you can see it's just a plain carbon handbrake cover And then we've also got this version Which obviously got the John Cooper Works and carbon on it So first of all we're going to show you how to remove this so basically you're going to get a nice clean flat head and obviously don't mark the silver in case you ever want to go back and you're just going to pry that forward so you can see on there there's two little clips there so obviously be careful not to snap them off so we'll get that out of the way now you'll see on this there's a like a rubber sleeve and that gives you that portion there and what you've got to do on that is lift that tab very slightly get that forward so you have to sort of pull on it that way and try and lift these tabs up as well he says so that's that one there's one on the bottom as well So there you can see there, under there is like a, a locking tab and that's what stops it sliding up and down. So once you've got that bit off there, it's a bit like the gear knob where you have to do it in reverse. So what you've got to do is you've just got to bend the sides of this one in and that'll release it. And then obviously when you do this, you'll see it's zip tied there in reverse. So obviously you zip tie it round and then you pull it back to give you that nice neat look there. So we'll take that bit off and obviously we're going to cut the zip tie I'm going to leave it inside out like this so we can do the new one so obviously we'll pull it back you can see the zip ties there this one to be honest isn't very tight so I don't need to cut it I'll just pull that off and then you're going to leave that like that so obviously that's the old one out and you've got that one like that so obviously with the new one We'll try this one first of all. So what happens is that goes on and zip ties around there and that will give you your neat finish at that end. But what you've got to do is you've also got to do these grub screws. So obviously what you're going to do is you're going to put that down, line it up until it's there. And then you're just going to put the grub, three grub screws in there obviously and tighten them over. I won't show you how to do that because it is pretty simple. So obviously with your three grub screws there, just insert them in, tighten them up. So at that point, you're going to have a tight handbrake, and then it's just a case of peeling that back. Obviously, you're going to have that tight at this point, and then clipping that down. So obviously, always remember inside out. So you always start like that and take it off again. So you can see on that one there where the grub screws are, and that's going to tighten up. Same again with this one. So obviously, with the full carbon one. You're going to insert it sort of back to front like that obviously i can reuse this one so once you've got that on you're going to pull that over it's probably best to put a new one on so new zip tie peel all that up get that flat I want them two bits there just to feed together So once you've got that on there, just make sure them bits are fed together. And then obviously once you pull it through, so you've got your original, basically how it was before, which will clip in there. And you can see now when you've got the zip tie on there, it gives that nice neat thing. So all you're gonna do with that one, is basically slide it back down. Just put that in. Well, these ones are very tight so obviously these are like a friction fit so obviously at that point you can see we've got the button we just need to go that little bit further so you just got to get a good grip on that and just keep prying it down okay, yeah. so once you've got this bit all nice and neat and lined up 
So obviously with the gator, it's this end in first and then squeeze the side and just click that back down and just obviously give it a, make sure that's in. So that's all in, that's lined up and it's just a simple case of, there you go. So all fitted, you can buy these on our website, www.kilochrome.com. Uh, loads of other stuff on there. Like I say, there's a few variations of these on the gear knob. So have a look on the website and see which one you prefer. Uh, keep liking, subscribing, sharing, etc. Thanks a lot for watching the video. You just take it slow. Fall asleep in the pillows. She got my heart in a chokehold.